I found a lot of history in this next drink. It's called Home on the Range. It's been around for a while. And I, when I found this cocktail in a quite iconic cocktail book um, by someone called uh, Crosby Gage. Oh, sure. Okay, Crosby CG. Gage. Exactly. Yeah. Um, and since then, it fell under the radar. Yep. And then it came back around 12 years ago. Sure. By someone called Sasha Petrasky. Sasha Petrasky, who hasn't heard of him, is pr a pretty much a legend. Yeah. And a young legend too. Unfortunately, we, yeah. we did lose him, unfortunately, in 2015, mm -hmm. uh, only age 42. But he was also the, the creator of an iconic bar in New York called the Milk and Honey. Right. Milk and Honey has actually developed quite a few iconic mixologists. Yes, absolutely. Including Sam Ross, right. who brought us the penicillin and the paper plane. Mm -hmm. But Sasha reinvented Home on the Range, and that's the version that I'm going to be doing today. Great, Sasha's Home on the Range. Sasha's Home on the Range is a stirrer, okay. and he swaps out two ingredients. Sure. So the original version, um, is actually made with rye and Dubonnet. Okay. Right? Um, Dubonnet, as we know, is a quite a sweet red wine aperitif. Queen Elizabeth's favorite. Yeah. It's, a, it's very much like a vermouth that has some bitterness to it. Exactly. Yeah. So he swapped out the rye with bourbon. Yeah. And swapped out the Dubonnet with sweet vermouth. Sure. So that's what I'm going to be making today. So we're going to be making Sasha's um, Home on the Range. Okay. So we're gonna put two ounces of bourbon. I'm gonna be using uh, four roses. So he is he is putting in a sweeter yes. whiskey. Yes. He's also taking a lot of the spice away. Because yes. rye is certainly a spicier type of whiskey. Yes. Uh, and Dubonnet is certainly a spicier type of um, of vermouth, so I'm interested Correct. to see. Yeah, I'm interested to see what he's I'm, up to. I'm gonna love. So we're gonna do a quarter ounce of sweet vermouth, right? And if you have some kind of triple sec, yep. it's great. We have the best we triple sec. We have the creme de la creme. Yeah, we have the expensive, oh, I said best. We have We're the no, expensive triple expensive. sec. Expensive. Yeah. Okay, um, and then three dashes of Angostura bitters. Got them. Gracias. De nada. And then we're gonna give it a quick one, two, Three. Oh, geez, that comes out pretty quick. Huh? It does. Yeah, it that does was, come out quick. Okay. I think you'll be fine. Um, yeah, the thing about the, the crazy thing about Angostura. They, I thought it was going to come out slow. After you get past about this part oh, of the Angostura. Oh, out. So this, from here to here, yeah. very slow. Then from here to here, very fast. And then from here to here, very slow again. That oh. is a uh, that is a real, like, feel it out situation. Need a itty bitty bit of lice. Yeah. Then Need we're going to. Like, stirs. Yes, please. We're going to stir this guy. So back in the day, they actually used to serve it straight up. Okay. Um, I know you're gonna say like, oh, you're using the spoon like wrong. I'm like, no. I wasn't gonna say anything. This I'm glad that correct, you're telling on yourself though. Correct. This is the. <laughs> would like to educate everyone that yeah. I'm using it correctly. You are not. As That's you fine. see, it's all in the wrist, not in the spoon. It is. Mm -hmm. We're gonna wait until your fingers feel a little chill. On the outside, just a little chill. Please, I need a beautiful cube. I have one right there for you. Thank you so much. Yeah. Wonderful. Yeah. We're just gonna make this amazing, just like that. Ooh. But a boom, but a bing. Almost looks like an old fashioned. Yeah. It's kind of a twist. Uh, very so, much a twist on the Manhattan, which is of course yes. then a twist on the uh, on the old fashioned. Correct. And oh yeah, look at that. Little orange there. There we go. And there's, very nice. There's your home on the range. That is a a, a very home pretty thing. on the range. Yeah. Okay. So uh, basically, what I'm looking for, I, I think I have an idea of what yes. the original tastes like. Yes. Uh, with so the spices. original is going to be. Rye, rye, which I'm sure you tasted. Spicy so, rye. the range, we've got rye. Mm -hmm. We have um, also triple sec. Right. But we do have Dubonnet. Right. And one dash of Angostura bitters. Adding the Angostura is his way of saying, I, I still want that bitterness Correct. in there that the Dubonnet gives and that the rye gives. But exactly. I want it to be more controlled by the uh, Ango. That's a... Exactly. Well done, Sash. Mm. 